Hey everyone, it's Chris Texera, and let's play another game of The Settlers of Catan. We are in the fourth spot. Not ideal, but let's take a look at the board. At least this is a board with a corner uh, desert, which should make it a little easier for us to find a spot. But we're going to be in the fourth spot here, so I do imagine some of these spots are going to go. It kind of depends which one. Like It's interesting that the two most highest producing spots are these two. He chooses the diversity here. Um, not really a surprise. Uh, there could be a or we cheap set up in here, potentially. Um, let's see. There is the 834, which is kind of mimics. It's pretty much the same one he took over here. Hmm. This is interesting. This is really nice, actually. Ten five nine. It's pretty good. Man, the only problem is, is like if we go without wheat or or. Oof. Okay. Well, hey, I made up our mind for us. Interesting. So, what do we do with this? Do we? Do we take something like the four eleven five nine three six and roll with it? That's a little risky. I mean we could. Or do we do like the three six eleven eight ten? Or do we do six three nine five eight? I do you like this nine four eleven spot? It's kind of calling to me a little bit. Nine four eleven eight ten eleven six three hmm. three one port. It's not easy. Or do we go 8-4? Maybe that's the right play. Get the 9-4-11-3-4-11. That's rough. It's not very good production. The 6-3-11. I, I almost like the 3-for-1. The I almost like the Yorwe cheat game here. We might be in the best position out of anybody to play it, to tell you the truth. Um, Got to decide. We're going to do that. We're going to do that. We're going to take the Orwee cheat game here. Three, six, nine. Do we take this? I think we do. Or do we take this? Maybe this is a little easier. Three, six, eleven. I don't like that as much because of the lack of sheep, but we're going to take this. It's certainly a little riskier. Let's point this way. We could potentially get to the ore port, uh, which would be pretty good. It's risky. This is not like, you know, the cleanest strategy in the world, but we'll see. I mean, it, it's certainly going to be interesting. We're going to be the slowest people by far, not loving it. We do start out with the port, which is nice. This is actually a kind of a useful spot because the other thing it does, it takes away this being a spot which reduces the likelihood of this 8-4 getting taken because if you have to choose between a port i think you take this one yeah i mean these guys everyone has a pretty decent setup to tell you the truth again we could have had everything we chose not to chose not to uh which is risky i'm a little surprised no one has gone here i think I would imagine this guy goes here and just consolidates his hold 
on the 9, 10, 11 points up. Unless he wants to go somewhere else. Um, I don't know why he would, though. I mean, I think this is the spot. If you're going to do it, could go here and then bounce this way. Actually, maybe this is the right spot. You go 9, 4, yeah, you point up. Yeah, that's the right spot. Exactly. There you go. And that makes sense. Give yourself the expansion spot, which is pretty groovy. Uh, you could actually just run straight to the brick port, which is pretty crazy. Um, we're pretty pleased, especially if we can get over here to this 8-4. It's not bad. We're going to be wanting woods and bricks here. And the crazy thing is, I think our target becomes this 6. Yeah, pretty heavily on this 6 here. we got to target that. Make sure nobody else gets it. All right, there's an or like that. Yeah, two sixes and a five rolled so far. So certainly going to be keeping an eye on some of these items. Nope. <clears throat> I'd love a brick. Anyone need sheep? I've got it. Sheep's going to be a rare commodity. Um, sheep is going to be a rare commodity. If we can get one... That'd be pretty nice, but let's see. Maybe these guys need it. Maybe they don't. Doesn't look like anyone's offering it. That's fine. We're gonna buy a card. Oh, we get a monopoly, right? That's what that is. Yeah, it's a monopoly. That's pretty sweet. That is a really, really big deal. We can get the mono. We really got to start tracking here. Okay. We got to start tracking big time. Five. Good block. We get an ore there. All right. Uh, how many cards do I have? Seven, five, and three. Let's see what people are doing. Yeah, we just have to like watch this like a hawk. It's a great block. I love when that happens when you move it and then boom, blocked. Hey, if you haven't subscribed to this channel, please consider doing so. I make daily Catan gameplay footage and upload it to YouTube for your viewing pleasure. Um, please like the video if you're enjoying it. Um, usually I'm on Catan Universe. However, I'm having a bit of a problem with Catan Universe right now. My game won't quit. So we have moved over to Colonist. And uh, I think we're actually going to continue on Colonist. I really don't see any reason why not. So we're still going to play Catan Universe, but we're also going to be on Colonist. Not going to be every day. Um, but, I mean, colonists is where the people are. So if we want to compete, let's make sure we are with all of the people. Two wood there. Can we get a wheat, perhaps, for a sheep? Wouldn't hate getting another card. You never know what you're going to get. Doesn't look like anyone's too eager. Uh, maybe we can get this. Maybe we can get this. Let's see what anyone's offering, if anything. So two wood rolled. No one seems particularly interested. That's fine. We'll pass. We're looking around, seeing what people bite on. And again, there's another five. Man, that five was an excellent block, potentially. There's a lot of wood out there. There's some wheat. Okay. We have a city in hand. Hmm. Sheep. All right, they gave three wood. That's interesting. Okay. Look at all these cards. All right, so everyone's pretty low on cards, with the exception of him. So. Ah, uh, bummer. Okay. What do we want to do here? Let's go. Let's hit the six. Maybe we can steal one. I think it's been rolled. Take from you. I got a wood. 
It's pretty good. I was hoping for maybe a wheat there. I didn't get it. All right, there's a three. That's a lot of sheepies. Sheepies everywhere, actually. More sheepies. All right. Some brick. Okay. Looking out for those bricks. Never know what you might get. Two. Can we get a brick? Anybody? Never know. Love, love, love me a brick. Doesn't look like we're getting one. Um, maybe we can get a sheep. What is this? Sheep and a thing for a brick. No, we're gonna. We're just gonna take a card. If you can't beat them, join them. There, jeez. There's the nine. Of course. Now we get it. Figures. Figures. That's the way it is sometimes. Alright. I mean, there are two bricks out there. A wood for a brick in the... Who's that? Red guy? I'll take that deal. For the two cards? Yeah, I'll take it. I'll take that. Even though we're giving up, we're giving we're, we're giving up to get, right? He is brick in abundance. Huh. Interesting. Get the city. Very useful. And we have some night insurance, which I really like. There's a six. Okay. Three. So many sheep. Um, let us build a city. We are in the game. We have got some sheep. Let's see what else we can get. Oh, that's a nice roll. Love that. Mm, man, if we can get to this three, that is a big deal. Or even to this 1092 somehow. I don't think that's going to happen. But you never know. More bricks, okay. We just want to park it on this six. Seven. That's really what we want. Let's see where this goes. I think this goes on our nine. Yep. It's going to come right back. Okay. What do we got here? Um, no. Wood for a sheep? I don't think so. I don't think so. Sorry. We need what we need. This is also pretty nice. We love this 8-4. That'd be a big deal if we can get that. That's not a terrible, but not what we need. For two sheep? No, I think we hit back on this six. <laughs> yeah, we hit back. Got a sheep. Hey, good, good unblock there. What do we want with that? Can we get for this? Mm -hmm. What do we want to do? I think we go one, two, three. Get a wood for a wood for a sh two sheep. How about it? That's fine. Um. You know, let's let's get the let's get the wood. Let's get the wood. Let's get that. We'll hold. <clears throat> Still have the monopoly hanging around. Nine. We're very, very slowly making progress. 
everyone's got the same thing. Everyone, <laughs> everyone has sheep and wheat right now, uh, which is, you know, which is fine. How much would I love to get here? My God, that would be nice. Oh, and over here, this 8-4 cannot be understated how valuable that is. I mean, we get another 9, we have it. Not that I really want to waste all this weed on it. Rob from the gray guy. Wow. I'm a, little, I'm a little surprised. I'm looking at us and I'm like, oh, wow, we did get it. And I'm looking at us and I'm thinking, aren't we the threat? Wow. Look at this. That's crazy. Nope. A lot of, a lot of stuff in here. A lot of stuff. Ah, uh, man. If we get another eight, I wonder if we mono, actually. Everyone has the same resources, which is, like, funny. Everyone has sheep. Everyone has wheat. Everyone has ore. But no one has anything else. Um, <laughs> it's just kind of wild. Wow, look at all those sheep for a wood brick. All of that for a road. Wow. Wow, and we got the five. Um, don't want to be stupid looking here. Let's see. We get this. What do the people need? I don't think anyone needs anything. That's the problem. Maybe there's a counter offer somewhere. I mean, man, I'm feeling pretty good. Um, I think we, I think we just take it. Yeah, I think we, I think we just take this. We have a chance for an expansion spot. Let's do it. We'll take it. I like that. So we managed to plow our friend over there. <clears throat> We're in great shape. Really good shape. I'm still, I'm, I can't believe these two guys only have two points. It's kind of astounding. I don't know what this guy's up to. Actually, we didn't even look at these guys. Let's see how they are. This dude... 29%. He's fine. Oh, there you go. Is that 12? Yeah, there you go. Gray guy is 27%. Nice. And this dude is 20%. All right, everyone's right around average. Wow. Um, we just buy cards. I mean, let's just go crazy here. There's really no reason why not. We got a victory point. We got a knight. We are well on our way. And with this uh, this awesome Monopoly sitting around, I mean, kind of hard to beat. Not on the six. Okay. And we get robbed. That's fine. Look at all that wood. Hmm. Wouldn't that be nice to steal? 12, good for you. Hmm, not our favorite thing there. Dude's in decent shape. Let's play the knight here. All right, we have two. Play here, take from you. Got a wood, hey, there you go. And we get an eight. Um, Would have loved some other cards there. Or a nice. Are there any other ore sitting around? I'm trying to wonder if maybe this is the right time to Milano for it. It's been a while. There were some back here. Anybody done anything with that? No, they haven't, have they? Is now the right time? No, I'm gonna hold. 
Nice. That is very helpful. I love that. He builds another road. <clears throat> I mean, the time is coming for that monopoly. The time is coming for it. Nice. Well, the time is probably going to be now. I think, I think, yeah, he, he needs, why would I do that? Oh, jeez. So wait, that was the good trade where he gets the big thing. Damn. What did he just do? Just do. The road builder card. Oh, and it's settled. Okay, on the board. To your 12 3 for 1 port. Man, that's rough. Look at all that wood. Okay. Hmm. Probably do a dirty mono in the next turn, potentially. I think he's got two. Yeah, I think he's got two. I know there's ore out there. Ore is probably going to be what we take. Because, man, would that be sweet. Especially if we can get to the sheep port. He bought a card. Oh, he bought a second card. Damn. Well, it's all gone now, I think. Or maybe not. Um, maybe I would. Oh my god, we screwed that up. I totally forgot we had the damn thing in there. Shoot. Ah, I misplayed again. God, I didn't misplay because I wanted to. I misplayed because the damn... Mm. Misplayed. Damn it. I misplayed because I still don't know the interface as well as I should. And that really cost us. Oh, I should have damn city. He had three. All right, we got to do a better job keeping an eye out for these eights. We didn't do a very good job. Five's good. Got to do a better job. Uh, nope. He's got two. Yeah, probably. Another eight rolls. That'd be nice. Five's nice. If I could get some wood for it. What is this? On a nine. Not good. Hits us. That's okay. Man. Again, if we hadn't misplayed here a couple times. And he bought a card. Seven. Hmm, tricky. A wood. It's by a card. We got a road built there. Well, that's interesting. Huh. That is very interesting. Huh. Okay. That could be our ticket to a win here. Because, again, if all we need, we have a settle in hand. Okay. Got to keep it on the eights. That's what we're looking for. We're looking for eights. When eights get rolled, we're going to feel really good about ourselves. I don't think he hits us. Does not. Look at all those wood, too. Mmm, juicy. I mean, this dude hasn't connected. I 
I'm going to feel pretty good if I can get this. All right. Let's see what rolls. Five. There's more wood out there. We don't need it. We're going to do the three for one for brick. Going to build our settle. And... Do we do the road build or do we wait? No one has anything. I think we hold. We're at six. We're, we're still in very good position. Very, very good position. Those threes are great. Look at all of those sheep. You might want a mono for the sheep. It's five sheep. Man. It's like the only thing out there. He's got two sheep or a sheep. He's got two sheep. He's got two sheep. Everyone's got sheep. Man, this sheep part. That's a big roll. <laughs> Jeez. I didn't realize how many people were getting sheep. All right. More sheep and some wheat over here. Which is not nothing. Let's see what these guys roll. I guess the question is, what's more valuable, the sheep or the wheat here? No one did anything. More sheep. Man. More sheep. And more wheat. Um, do we mono for four wheat? Or do we take all those sheep? Um, I think we... What do we road build? One, two, three. I think we mono for the wheat here. Yeah. It's so valuable. I'm going to take that. Let's do for this. Build the city. All right, seven. Let's go get this and this. Two, three. One, two, three. Uh, let's buy two cards. Uh, all right, we are well on our way. So we're close to the road, close to the army. We, we are in the driver's seat here. I don't think anyone's going to catch us. Um, it's going to be pretty hard for them to do so. Got especially if we can take, especially if we can take the road. Can you imagine? Um, yeah. I don't know if they're going to be able to, too. We're going to see. I mean, there's wood out there. We have two, two ore. That alone could potentially, we could potentially win this with uh, a three or an eight or a five or a nine if it was unblocked because we have the two or we have the, the or port. Well, actually, I take it back. Um, not the two, nine. We need the eight or the five or the three. If we get any of those rolls, we can win with the longest road and the largest army, uh, which would be pretty, pretty crazy. I'd love that. So we'll see. We'll see. I think, I think this game's over here pretty soon. But we haven't won yet. Because again, we still need to build the road and connect it without alarming anybody. We haven't done that yet. Because yeah, we can only play one of these at a time. Um... No, I don't really see a reason to help you. Yeah, at this point, we're just kind of playing it solo. Because, I mean, we're in such a good position. We're going to see. We're going to see. All right, two or. What's he up to? What's he just do? Oh, you're plenty. Took, oh, he's got a city. There he goes. Got a city. Good for him. One, two, three. Amazingly, no one's taken this yet. We're going to play our knight. Get over here. 
Yeah. Took from you. Got a wood. Nice. Six. Um, we could just try to win it here. I don't really see a reason. Or do we want to hold? Let's build a road. And we'll hold. And potentially, we could just win it next turn. Let's see if we set up ourselves up for the longest road next turn. I don't know how anyone hasn't built the longest road yet. But we could also draw for a victory point. Either way, I mean, again, we're in pretty good shape. No one's catching us on the army, I don't think. We have a knight in hand. Sure. We'll accept that. Yeah, give us that card. We'll love it. If anything, that gives us another route. Maybe he connects here. Has been over compared to ten. Uh, he's probably right. Could be. Yeah, I, I can't say I remember. I can't say I remember the last time. And was rolled. It was definitely a while ago. <laughs> Ten was rolled. Um, oh man. Well, this game's very well. Yeah, that'll that'll do it. GG, GG. Let's get it. And just like that. We get the 11 points. Pretty easy, that one. Much easier than the previous one. And obviously, the first two were complete dumpster fires. I think we, I mean, we're still, you, you've seen it in this game and in the last game. We're making mistakes because the interface is unfamiliar with us. The style is unfamiliar with us. Again, we're just not that comfortable. But, you know, we've been making the right moves. We've been making the right moves in these two games. And I think the first two games, we were just a little too kind of panicked and frizzle, frazzled, but last two, we've really kind of settled down here and uh, done what we do best, which is kick some butt and win. Oh, yeah, this was uh, this was not close. 11.65, really nice. I don't even know what all these things mean. Victory points in largest road. Oh, yeah, that's what makes sense. Dice stats. Yeah, those tens didn't roll too often. Really, what won this game was that six and the eight. Uh, that nine was super helpful. Actually, you know what? all of these numbers in the middle here. And that, that was the benefit of our spot, right? Even though we only had three resources, they're the resources meant for cards and cities. And we got them in droves, right? And man, those threes, when those did roll up, was really helpful. Yeah, so I'm very pleased with that. Um, yeah, like no brick. That is the funny thing. God, it was so much of it. it just was never drawn. Dev cards drawn. You see it here. Very cool. Uh, we got the activity stats. Yep. We actually didn't get any trades proposed, which is pretty funny. Amount of use resources used, blocked, bought, etc. And there you go. We had 87 income, which is kind of nuts. Lost 33. Total resource score 54. Definitely the most efficient. We did have to discard. Uh, we did gain by trading. That was a very good win. I'm very pleased with this one. Uh, makes me optimistic about the next couple of games here on Colonist, and hopefully we can continue. Do have to be back on uh, Catan Universe pretty soon, but we'll see. It's kind of up to when I when that game will quit. I literally can't get on it to play. So that's what it is. Thank you all for watching. We will see you next time.